Listen, man, I, I really don't even know how to get into the story without even just being slightly heated, but I will try. I'm just gonna get straight into it. Juice World died in 2019, I believe, right? According to Google, December 8, 2019, and I remember making a video on that. I was very sad about the situation because, I mean, Juice World was a very talented individual, and a lot of people connected to his music at the time, especially when we were all younger. But at this point in time, I'm getting mad because I recently found out, and excuse me if I'm late to the story, as far as I can tell, this news story just dropped, of Juice Juice World's ex-girlfriend, Ali Alati, who's now apparently famous. She has 1.4 million followers on Instagram, of course, through the help of Juice World's death and her capitalizing off of his fame. And I'm not sure if she's struggling for money or not, but apparently, based on what I've seen recently on Twitter, she's now selling his clothes, his personal belongings, things like, in this screenshot, his boxers for $200. And this was posted to her OnlyFans, and I believe leaked by one of her subscribers. Also, she's selling a mystery dirt laundry pack one of ten for twenty five hundred dollars a preserved juice world dreadlock for one hundred dollars by the way that's his hair she's selling for 100 and she says there's a special deal for 10 individual pieces for a thousand bucks a dalmatian supreme tea as we can see here that juice world wore that was once a part of his wardrobe for 550 dollars a one of one so yellow puff jacket for twelve thousand five hundred dollars his regular tooth 100 dollars a sharp tooth 250 dollars and a molar for a thousand bucks an ounce yes ladies and gentlemen she's selling his body parts now which i why does she even have his teeth a one ounce vial of juice's juice for ten thousand dollars yes ladies and gentlemen she's selling juice's juice how is that even possible for ten thousand dollars i'm really hoping this screenshot is fake and she also said thanks guys i work really hard for what i have right now life is great and as you can see here is the photos of everything that she's trying to sell and screenshots of all this stuff and it's just like this is disgusting completely reprehensible and this wicked bitch ali lottie needs to respond to these allegations why is she trying to sell this man's personal belongings his physical attributes his hair his juice his boxers his coats and all that like that is completely disgusting if true you know it's just crazy and here i see another screenshot i'm not sure if this is doctored or not but there are other items she's selling a supreme louis v hoodie for three thousand a chanel one of five pearls twenty five hundred bucks legends never die one of one studded jacket twenty three hundred a transparent lv backpack two thousand a leather louis vuitton jacket two thousand versace fur jacket seventeen fifty fully studded jacket fifteen hundred twenty five a supreme skull hoodie 1300 gucci jockers 700 dollars a one of one v loan shirt 500 dollars a babe coat 300 and supreme goggles for 75 she says also everything is gently worn and in great condition i really need to get rid of this stuff fast please dm me if interested signed ali lati from her own personal only fans page this is crazy she also and it gets even worse it, it really you thought that was bad but it gets even worse according to people juice world fans so this fan by the name of 999 Bucky or X2 Bucky on Twitter. He said, Ali Lottie is now using her X Juice World for clout and clickbaiting for a fake sex tape. What has this world come to? And on her OnlyFans page, she posted a screenshot saying, Fuck it, leaking my sex tape. Hackers keep threatening me to leak my old sex tapes. I am so fucking done. I don't give a fuck. Sending it out myself was some of the best black dick I ever got. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, she's objectifying this man by referring to him as black dick. Check your DMs to see unsending this for ever tonight and as we can see in the screenshot which is obviously going to be highly censored we can see juice world's face and ali lati in front of him with words captioned obviously i'm going to censor this getting fucked by my ex shocked emoji devil emoji and apparently based on what this juice world fan said this is clickbait i'm not sure if she actually leaked it or not whether she actually shared video of juice world screwing her but somebody said this is fucked but I'm kind of curious if he was packing. And another fan responded back by saying, hey man, seek a father figure. Yeah, I mean, that is, why, why would you even ask something like that, bro? Like, what? what? is wrong with you man and according to this post ali lottie after allegedly using that as clickbait posting the video whether it was fake or not made two hundred and fifty thousand dollars in 24 hours and if true then i i've lost all hope the fact that she's even using that as clickbait to suck money out of juice world's fans is crazy the fact that juice world's fans are even signing up to her only fans to pay for that content is crazy and the fact that she's not being locked up or charged by the family or sued for defamation or anything like this is just wild like where's the accountability isn't this considered revenge porn isn't that illegal here we have another screenshot from a person who's actually subbed to ali lottie's page it says hey can i buy the supreme louis vuitton hoodie she said hi yes it's three thousand 
I can have it shipped out tomorrow if you want it. A lot of fans are offering to buy it, so it's gonna sell pretty soon. They say okay, and I just tip the money and then send my Addy. She says yes. Disgusting. And then you have weird ass Adam22, the certified cuck himself, and his wife promoting Ali Lottie and her OnlyFans. Lena the plug says Hottie Ali Lottie wants you to <clears throat> join her shower fund. Surprise in the comments. Like that is just weird. Why would you say that? And what's even weirder is the fact that Adam22 came out and said, if you have a famous boyfriend, referring to Juice World, and he dies, here are some suggestions. Don't sell his clothes or give them to your next boyfriend. Don't leave annoying comments on everyone's IG post to promote your OnlyFans. Don't release your sex tapes with said X on OnlyFans. Maybe also don't get arrested for shoplifting and meth possession. This has been my TED talk. Then somebody said to Adam, is it even legal to release a sex tape of a dead person without consent, let alone sell it? And Adam22 said, on OnlyFans, you have to tag anyone who appears in any video. So I'm skeptical about if she would actually post anything with him in it it's probably just only fans marketing which is even more depressing and i'm not gonna lie unfortunately i do have to agree with adam this is probably just fake and she's using it as marketing which in my opinion like he said is even more depressing like it's the fact that she would even bait having a sex tape with him and releasing it to the platform is even just downright more foul and disgusting man but i just want to know why after you saying this about ali lotti is your wife now promoting ali lotti on her own twitter page according to drama alert but according to adam 22 to the explanation for that is that she bought a promo post that's it huh so money trumps morals you come out against ali lottie explaining your opposition to what she's doing now but then your wife accepts money or you probably did for the promo post and now everything you said before just flies out the fucking window wow good to know that i could never trust adam 22 if he were my friend give enough money he would probably stab me in the back too what's even more bizarre is the fact that this crazy bitch after juice world died started saying he was sending her signs from the grave and and she was seeing all sorts of things that Juice World was sending her personally. When I tell you that, okay, so a couple days before Jared passed away, we were all in here chilling. Lights were off because we were watching a movie, um, all of us. And all of a sudden, the lights turned on. Like, click, 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 click. And you could hear it. Like, we turned on the TV because it happened again. And click, 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 click. No one was, what? You know what I mean? Like mind blown everyone was mind blown that we like freaked out and then didn't talk about it because it was so real like too real whatever um obviously i've been in the room for the past couple months barely late like i literally barely leave my room um when i tell you that just now i was laying in bed and the lights went on three times turned off happened over here twice on that side and over here with those lights right here one and that's what happened before and i just am like bro I, like what like ali I, I assure you that 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 was not a sign from juice world from beyond the grave i'm i'm sure your high ass was out here smoking meth crack mexican beady balls and all types of drugs and you thought some lights flickering which does happen in my house too sometimes occasionally was a sign from juice world specifically to you like lady maybe lay down the pipe and actually stop using this man's fame fortune his clout and everything in between for personal gain and now is getting so crazy to where people are thinking that she may have been the one who killed juice a dot hayes brooks said i think she killed juice he had just enough time to make her relevant and then said mess it up alone lol toten said we wish you went instead of juice somebody said it's wild you haven't even od'd yet we wish we could have e-traded juice for you trash somebody said disgrace and disappointment i know juice looking down mad as hell at you disgusting behavior angelica xo said i was literally on your side this entire time until that post about jay's shit you are sick i'm gonna assume you're strung out bad or just a shitty human being now if somebody wants to provide me context as to who jay's shit is let me know is she talking about juice world stuff she is indeed selling his clothes right now so that's what she's likely referring to holly marie said a motherfucking disgrace to juice's legacy maddie said i I hate you nicole said you're gross mj say i hate you luca said absolute moron k said literal dirt alexis said i hate you and so on and so forth everybody is cooking this woman and rightfully so in the comment section she literally is exploiting juice world's name his memory and everything else in between 
for money. Disgusting. People are saying you're a piece of trash. You no one's favorite. Keyword fallen. Sicko. Sick fuck. And she does look like a sick fuck, man. Disloyal. Disgusting. No morals. And it's just like, damn, bro. She doesn't even look like herself anymore after all this surgery. And I'm just checking on Twitter to see if she's made a statement. And of course not. The last post was last year, November 17th, 2023. And she has yet to make a public statement addressing why she's selling his stuff to the public without probably even the family's permission. Anyway, though, let me know your thoughts and opinions down below. How would you feel if you died? Well, you probably wouldn't be feeling anything, but hypothetically speaking, if you could, your wife, your girlfriend started selling your shit to the public, to random people who don't even care about you for money because you were famous, exploiting your fame, your clout, and your memory for a quick buck. Honestly, I'm just going to say I'm not surprised. I'm not shocked by this behavior. This is why you got to find you a loyal one. And I, I, I want to find that for myself one day, but it's just hard. Too many trust issues. People will try and exploit you for the wrong reasons just to try to use you for a come up. And I, I just want to stay far away from that, man, honestly. But do let me know your thoughts and opinions down below. Like the video, by the way, sub to the channel. Join our Discord server down below. All links are down below. And hope you guys all enjoyed and new video tomorrow.